chat, start a uh, start a running tally. Things Chaos did not expect from this playthrough. Jet's immediate crush on Ash. <laughs> Top of the <laughs> list to start. Swimming through a sea of countless books, tracking down that single sought-after volume. It's absolute bliss. How do the poor fools who spend their days sharpening swords and polishing armor find any joy in life? Dude, swords are great. They are pretty cool. They're pretty awesome. Flane has trapped us in the McDonald's play place. Oh, those memes <laughs> are so good. I'll show you them after this jet, but the, um, Setes voice actor, uh, people would make, like, little miniature scripts of him, like, giving a quest. It would be, like, like, M Flane and I are trapped in the McDonald's play place. We haven't gotten to eat our order. Could you please help us? And then Setet's voice actor voiced a lot of them and uploaded it to Twitter. <laughs> it was fantastic. We'll watch we'll some of them later. It. Yeah, it's very good. Um, What else was I here for? No, I already got the thing I needed. Yeah, I just need to report back to the chef, right? Bum, 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 bum. You're not expecting it is on you? Ash is, a, Ash is cute? I, I never realized that about him. That's my bad. Yeah. <laughs> Here's what I need. Give. Thanks for your help. There we go. Now we have battalions, which is one of the big strategy things that makes this game so much more fun than the other Fire Emblems to me. Don't think we need anything else in here. Where is Ash? Good question, me. I think he's dead. No, I don't think that's possible. I think that everyone. Okay, calm down. Okay, calm down. Calm down. Ash isn't going anywhere. I'm pretty sure that all of the students are always available to be spoken to every month. There might be a one-off here and there. I'm not sure, but for the most part, they are. Some of the faculty isn't available depending on the month. From far off lands gather here at the academy. Like sometimes, I think Sedeth is always around, but like sometimes Alois isn't around. Sometimes Shamir isn't around, etc. Got it. Word of advice, Professor. There are those who don't think kindly of such people. Dissidents in town. Don't forget to check Abyss. Oh, do we already have access to Abyss? I thought they'd give me a side quest to like let me into Abyss later. Oh, nope, there it is. Yeah, Yuri, Balthus, Constance, and Happy. We're gonna recruit all of them. Yay! What the? Wait, where am I going? Oh, right, I need to find Ash. Yep. Which wouldn't be on my yes. way mark. Oh, hello. For some students, this will be their first time stepping onto a real battlefield. It's important that they're mentally prepared. As for me, <laughs> do I look green to you? Is there anything else you wish to ask me about regarding spending your time at the monastery or battles? I'm good to go. Thank you. I fully accept the necessity of real battle from time to time. But it is still a surprise to be tasked with punishing bandits without warning. It is a rather different sort of mission. It makes me wonder what the Archbishop is planning. I wonder indeed. All right, Ash must be in his room, in the Blue Lion's room. Yes. It's thanks to my adoptive father, Lenato, that a commoner like me is here at the Academy. He is the very model of chivalry. Someday, I'm going to be just like him. Good for you. Yep. What what stats do you need, actually? It's thanks he is the... Huh? You're... In, I'm really flattered, honestly. But I still have a lot left to learn in my current one. That's charisma? That's charisma. Charisma and Lance. Lance? You're normally a bow unit. Lance? <laughs> what the heck? Guess he just digs it. Dining hall. Food time. Right. You're a lifesaver. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Well, if we recruit Ash, his paralog gives us a, a permanent movement upgrade on a character, which will be pretty nice. Yay. Which I'll probably immediately throw at Edelgard. Abyss. We're in the abyss. I can answer why Ash requires Lance. Is there an actual reason for it? What is it? I didn't realize they would put me through a loading screen for Abyss. Ah, well, it's fine. <laughs> All 
All right, so this is the DLC area. Mm, cool. The only reason we're here, and oh, dude, an influencer, yo, dude. Can I get you to play my new indie Need game? Something. Exchange for renown, we'll gather more people to abyss. This will unlock new activities. I'm not gonna use renown on soon. this. I'm gonna use renown on the other thing. Happy, this is my favorite of the abyss characters. Wait, shut up, let me guess. <laughs> You're that new professor, right? You just started teaching up on the surface. Have we met before? Nah. Even here people have been talking about you. Not that the gossip got everything right. I heard you were beautiful, but obviously that was an exaggeration. He is a Disney princess! Excuse <laughs> you! You want to know if I can help out? I've got time, but I don't want to spend it all serving the church. Don't make that face. Fine, fine. I'll back you up. Yeah, sure thing. You know, I've never really had a teacher before. And it'll be my first time at the Officer's Academy. Sounds like fun. Yay! Oh, I love her. Oh, Chatterbox. You have been looking for me? I'd prefer not to visit the surface if I can help it. I don't want to run into any knights. Happy gives everyone nicknames. Nice. I did not realize her nickname for Byleth was Chatterbox, though. That's funny. <laughs> yeah, you're such a Chatterbox, Where you know? are the other three? Here we go. And who might you be? Not an Abyssian. That much is clear at a glance. Ash needs Lance because of Lonato. Oh, because Lonato uses a Lance, he looks up to him. I Pretty more basic than I thought, but works, I guess. A visitor from above, perhaps? With what purpose? I'm just looking around. I'm sure yeah. I must have misheard you. Either that, or you haven't the slightest inkling of where you are. Oh, but of course! You must be the new teacher specially appointed by Lady Rhea. That is it, yes? Oh, wait a minute. My Sly, someone was asking for Sly's channel. My Sly command is his Twitch channel. Did I make a Sly YouTube command? There you go, there's Sly's channel. He's been uploading the Blue Lions playthrough that we're doing together if anyone in chat wants to watch that. Rumors have been flying underground about you. Well then, I am Constance Von Nouvelle. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. <laughs> Join. Oh, have you come to beg my assistance? Then rejoice, for you have the aid of a new bell. You did come seeking my aid, yes? Hopefully with something befitting my station. An assignment for the Officers Academy? How splendid. I was a former attendee there myself, you know. I shall be a model of grace in my duties. Bam, 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 bam. Whoever you are, it doesn't matter much to me. But I do advise getting out of here before you get tangled up in trouble. Unless you've been sent here under someone's orders. In which case, I'll happily show you a good time. <laughs> I'd heard about Abyss, so I came to find it. Well, I do like people with a healthy curiosity. You are aware of how dangerous it is down here, yeah? Huh. You're that mercenary turned professor, aren't you? The one who showed up at the monastery kind of recently. Yeah, you're the one I've heard so much about. Well, I guess it's fine you're here then. You can call me Yuri. You'll want to remember that, if you ever come down here again. Want my help, hmm? Sure, sure, why not? But I don't do anything for free. In exchange, let me attend the lectures you give those noble kids, yeah? It's a deal. Come on by whenever you need me. If you're wondering why I won't come up to you, it's because I've got people to watch over in Abyss. Bum, 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 bum. Abyss. Huh? I mean, I know this is all the DLC stuff, but what is, like, in, in story, like, I guess in game, uh, Abyss's deal? Kind of. I mean, oh, Abyss is an under, it's an underground location where people who, like, for some reason or another are not really welcome or need to hide from the outside world. Um, there's a specific priest who watches over them, so they kind of have the church's sanctioning, but the church also is like, do not leave the underground in exchange because they're people that aren't really wanted in society for one reason or another. So they're, they're all basically just a bunch of outcasts, and the four that matter are the four we're recruiting right now. These two happy, and then we're about to go get Balthus. Huh. 
come to invite me to a lesson or some such, have you? I prefer not to be above ground during the day when I can help it, unless there are storm clouds above. Ah, it's you. Bit of a trek coming all the way down here, huh? I'll be helping you out now. But just so you know, my life is still down here. If you can't find me in the classroom on the surface, you'll likely find me here instead. All right, now where the heck is Balthus? Where is my boy? Right over here. Really? I haven't seen your face before. You're clearly not Damn. from around here. He ripped. Yeah, you could grind meat on those. Yep. You don't strike me as the thief or merchant type. I don't owe you money, do I? <laughs> he owed me money. <laughs> I'm a former merc. Oh, you're that new teacher everyone's been yapping about. Funny. Thanks to me, you don't look so tough. The name's Balthus, formerly of the Alliance. Don't beat around the bush, pal. You want my help, yeah? Can't blame you. Look, I get it. You're the new professor. You've got a lot on your plate. You need backup? I'm your guy. Fine, you've talked me into it. But I'm gonna need you to sweeten the deal if you catch my drift. Beautiful! Now about that sweetening. Yes, here's some Splenda. I'll need to attend your classes whenever the mood strikes. You get bored from time to time, all cooped up. Bum -bum. Well, did you come all the way here just to <laughs> stare at my rippling abs, or did you want something? No, I just wanted to stare at them. Yeah, I can get behind that as well. If you're gonna ask me for help on the surface, it better be real important. I try not to go up there unless I absolutely have to. He actually has, uh, we're not gonna, I don't think we're gonna get to see it much at all because it happens a little bit in the DLC and then I assume he has supports with Hilda in the main game, but we can't recruit Hilda. <laughs> but, uh, Hilda and Hilda's brother and Balthus all knew each other growing up. Got it. Each of the, um, each of the four Cindered Shadows characters, they're the Ash and Wolves house, they... I don't actually know if Yuri comes from a specific one, but they're all, like, linked to one of the places. I think Happy is primarily from the Kingdom, uh, Constance is from the Empire, and then Balthus is from the Alliance. And I don't know if they ever established Yuri as being from any of them. I think he was, like, outside of them, basically, but... Is the DLC, like, something that would take place instead of what happened, or did it take place after? The it should take place pre-time skip, where you go through meeting them. It's weird. Like, it's set, like, time-wise, where it would happen during, like, chapter 8 or 9, before the time skip. But then when you play yeah. the main game and recruit them, it just doesn't reference what happens story-wise in the DLC, like, at all. Uh, I've never gotten to time skip with the DLC characters, so I assume, like, what the game does is it pretends pre-time skip that you didn't do the DLC, like, events, like the storyline, but then probably post-time skip it assumes that you have done it? I'm actually going to learn that as we go through this, <laughs> how that works, because I don't know. Well done. You have my thanks. But the, the DLC story is basically just meeting the Abyss people and then that bishop I told you about who's like in charge of them for the church, basically. He um, betrays them because he gathered those four characters, Constance, Happy, Balthus, and Yuri all together because each of them has a crest related to four special priests from back in the day. And he brings it, spoilers for Cindered Shadows DLC, okay. chat if any of you care. But I played it on the channel a few months ago. But uh, he gathered them all together because they all have the crests that he needs where he tries to do a special ritual by killing them to bring Byleth's mother back to life because he was in love with Byleth's mom. And then we like join we join the uh, the Ashen Wolves and help them turn the tables and kill the bishop instead. Yay! Give, but it's supposed to like I I could tell that it's supposed to take place like during, like somewhere in chapter like nine to eleven or something like that. I don't remember, but it doesn't uh, it doesn't make that. Uh, I don't know how it ties into the main game. We'll see how it goes. Pretty much. All right, full menu. Uh, we don't have to worry about points with the Ashen Wolves right now. I actually want to go ahead and get a jump on getting points. What, what, which two characters do you want recruited the most, Jet? Uh, You'll get there, I believe in you. I really want Mercedes, uh, Ash, and... I'm, I'm, there's Mercedes a lot of characters Ash, I'm trying to There, there are a lot of them, yeah. 
Uh, Can I get a dish that both Mercedes and Ash like right now? Uh, I mean, I guess also we could work I on Felix. I didn't see uh, Ash in there at all. Oh, you don't gotta, Cynthia. you don't gotta worry about Felix. I'm gonna get Felix. I mean, Felix. I know you. I know you. <laughs> hey, I also know you. What are the odds? Hey. Where? Okay, you know what? Give me um. This is up on Mercedes, and oh no, there is Ash right there. Perfect, Ash and Mercedes. Yay. This is my absolute favorite. How did you know, Professor? This looks delicious. Let's eat. I don't know why I'm sitting through this. It's like throwaway dialogue. Anyways, we're trying to get points with people and build up the professor level as fast as possible because the faster you build the professor level, the more action. Like, we just ran out of actions for today. We can't do anything else. That's why we want the professor level to go up to get more. What are you guys' favorite team compositions? Uh, Felix? Felix. <laughs> um, Dorothea to magic the things that Felix can't stab. And then Linhart to teleport Felix into the things that he can stab. <laughs> it's pretty much what I go for. What, what's your favorite team comp? Have you heard of Lysithia? Have you not been told also what's true? expected from lectures here? Well, I can tell you how it works based on what I've heard from other professors. Yeah, please, student, teach me how to teach real quick, if you wouldn't mind. Yeah, because, you know, they just threw it, threw me into this. I'm, I'm also a fan of team comp that is give Thyrsis to Lysithia and then let her nuke everyone. It's very fun. All right, I know how to do the instructing. So the way this works, Jet, is this is why they have the little smiley face-like motivation. So you can instruct them as many times as they have motivation. So we can do four sessions here to boost their their skills and whatnot. We need to get these numbers up for them to get new skills, get abilities, and most importantly, be able to advance to uh, higher level classes. Right. So okay. some people are naturally good at things, like Edelgard is naturally good at authority, heavy armor, axes and sword, and some people are naturally bad at things, like Edelgard sucks at bows and healing magic. She's not good with them. This little arrow pointing up means that I had it's professor expertise, so my rank, because I also, the professor also has these like ED ranks, etc. Byleth does. My fist rank is higher, or my brawling rank is higher than Edelgard's, so if I teach her in it, then she gets more points than usual because I know more than her about it by default. Got it. Um, we have three people to teach. We're gonna teach the three best girls because they're all maxed out. It's them and Linhart, so one of them has to be left out. We're gonna leave out Linhart on this one. But we also get more, we can teach three people this time. We get more of that as our professor rank goes up as well. Got it. Um, Edelgard, uh, just teaching you and your main things. I'm not particularly planning on doing any really weird uh, classes, chat. In the blue lines run I'm doing with Slyro, he's trying to do some weird stuff with some characters. I'm not planning on doing anything specifically weird because it's just not something I normally do. And also we're going to, we're doing a big recruit run. So we're going to recruit a lot of people. So having a lot of people and also trying to make them do weird things at the same time is, uh, it can get iffy. What up, up, so also some people have, well, I think everyone has one actually, but you just saw in Dorothea, they have the little three stars. Actually, some people don't have it because Petra doesn't. Where's another one who does? Kaspar? Kaspar doesn't. Linhart? Okay, can I click into a single character that has the three star mechanic? Thank you. So when they have the three little stars, it means if you train them in it enough, then they get something unique. It's like their hidden oh, okay. skill thing. So for gotcha. Dorothea, it's healing magic, which is good because we want to get her healing magic higher. It'll, a lot of times if their hidden talent thing is in something that they're bad at because Dorothea is not good at faith, it'll change it from them being bad at it to being good at it. Got it, okay. I'm just gonna train you in sword for now. I, I'm pretty sure Petra normally leads towards being a trickster, which is like a dodge sword unit. I normally put her on a bird, though. Bird. But anyways, if the when we get a better look at classes a little bit later, Jet, if there's any specific class that you want someone to be, we can probably make it happen. Tell Unless you tell me to make someone something ridiculous and I tell you now. But otherwise, if you have like, I want to see this unit be this, then we can probably make it happen. Got it. 
Also Pretty soon I'll have eaten everything they have to offer in the dining hall. Then what am I supposed to do? Keep eating the same boring meals over and over again? What were you gonna say? Mm, none, go ahead. You should try cooking something new. I'm not sure about Okay, he doesn't like cooking. Alas. Right. If you get a better answer, then he gets more motivation, but you get professor points either way. Sometimes the units will be like, hey, I want to focus on this instead of what you told me to focus on. I should have looked at everyone's goals really quickly. I forgot to do that. Oh, well, it's fine. They'll be fine on the default for the first week. Yeah. Birthday. Say a name. Say a name. Uh, I don't know. I won't forget all I've learned. x -Pros. I finally get it. I finally get it. Punch. Whose birthday is it? Raphael. All right, ignore. <laughs> um. All right, so now they're going to make us do a battle this this day. Jet, so just do... Heads up is three hours. Yeah, I was, uh, I was literally about to say, do you want to go for another hour or do you want to stop here? Nah, I gotta stop here. I gotta pick up my sister. Your sister? Doesn't she understand that we're doing very important things right now? Yeah. <laughs> the game says we've only played two hours and 40 minutes because of that one loss. That's funny. <laughs> oh, what a time. All right, we'll wrap up here for today then. Uh, chat, it might be a little while before the next three houses stream, but we'll get to them as quick as we can. But uh, yeah, good stuff. Good first stream. We're, uh, we're getting underway. Yay. Getting underway. Jet, thank you for joining me. For those of you Thank watching, you for, for those of you watching on YouTube, if you want to watch live, link to my Twitch channel in the description, or keep watching on YouTube, I appreciate your support either way. And until next time, farewell. <laughs>